Okay, hi. Welcome. Welcome back to some more of The Walking Dead. We are today going to be playing the 400 Days, I think it is, DLC. Right, definitive menu? No. Play. I did that one. There we go. <laughs> okay, it's gonna be a minute. I'm wondering, should I brighten it up or is it okay? No, I think it's okay. Play. I feel like it looks very dark. I don't know. It's been so long. I think if you, uh, if I kept it in, it's been a long time. Kenny? I could sworn that was Kenny. These people that are missing or have like turned into walkers. Oh no, missing. So weird seeing how different it all is. Oh. Wyatt. For a long time I thought that was what? Yeah, because <laughs> in my West End show, I had like a sidekick or kind of like a bully buddy with that name. Oh, are we playing as God, this is so fucked. Why the hell did you shoot that guy, man? What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened, okay? <laughs> Where the fuck I didn't were mean you with a warning? Him. You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Or Shit! Dude, how'd they catch up to us? Who gives a shit? Just... Hurry up, Eddie! Here, man, shoot! Uh, uh, Get him, man! I don't know how I feel about this. Jesus, man. Jesus. God. Okay, he took out the headlight. Holy shit, man, did you get him? Are they back there? Wyatt? Dude, are they there or not? Come on! Wyatt, talk words at me, man! I don't see anything. Are you sure? Those guys wouldn't just give I up. I don't see anything. Here, here, I'll turn off. This is the only reason why I don't like connection controller in this game is because it has the mouse still on there. It's really weird. I don't know why it does it. Feel that look on me, man. I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. I can't see a damn thing out here, man. Just, man, I don't so want to make I guess them angry. Yeah, it makes sense, Wyatt. God, I can't believe we're in this shit. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please, this road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? Fuck no. Did you see that one guy's eyes, man? He's fucking gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. <laughs> you are covered in that guy's blood. I know, Wyatt. My shirt is soaked. It's like, I just, why didn't they say anything? Did you mean to pull the trigger? I don't know. I was so keyed up, I just, damn it, look. Wyatt, all I know is those guys had me all jacked up like I was on speed or something. I was just on edge, you know? Oh, I see the blood now. Yeah. And I was like watching that guy's brains come out of the back of his head. I'm sorry, man. I.
Well, thanks for getting us out anyway. I don't know. <laughs> he appreciates that at least, you know. Cool times, cool times. Let there be light, huh? Dude, shut up. Turn it off. See, it's fine. Road straight as my dick. You okay. Think we're in the clear? <laughs> Not till we get out of this fog. I wanted to choose option A. Was that a pun? No. When did you start making puns? I said How was no, that a idiot. pun? Okay. I'm clearly missing out on something. But. <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Please never talk again. See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. Foggy. Oh my what? God! What? Shut up. I can't see anything out there. Who are you talking to? You? Oh, what did you say? Remember when TJ got high and tried to put a pancake in the CD player? No. <laughs> I don't see anything. Dude, it's in there. Look harder. I don't see it. What I do see is that ammo that you lost last week. Oh my god, really? But is there any weed? You know, one time I was going out with this girl. Right? Abigail, being smart. You remember her? She told me that... She was five, I think. Her dad think loading the gun is probably more important right this second. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Weird, but okay. Shit! Ah! That scared me. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. Did you get a look? I think that was a guy. I right? think it was a walker. Come on, man. Say something. Was that a dude or not? What the... The fucking fog. This night is so fucked, man. It didn't look human. Alive. Whatever. Really? Seriously? I mean, seriously? Well, it's probably not now, but... Look me in the eyes and say that. Regardless. <laughs> I could be wrong. I'm just saying it didn't look human to me. You are wrong. Why do you even ask me if you're not going to listen? Obviously, because I hate when people do that. Me. Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll like tell us one way or the other. That way we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just not. I respect it. I actually respect him. You know, good on you, Eddie. Good on you. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's part of a shirt, I think. Yeah, but plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh? Look fresh to you? Rotten. Yeah, but it's kind of dark. Why would it yeah. be? Damn. What's that way out in the road? Why would you just have casually have glass on your window screen? Is that the mirror from the car? can't tell from here. I feel like they're being really dumb. Yeah, I'm really not seeing anything. Get the gun out. Seriously, Wait, no, the gun was on top. That guy oh, made it into the glove box. Man, I don't know. Stop messing around. We need to know what's going on, okay? That's not going to happen. I have okay? no option. Oh, geez. Look. Wyatt. It was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't pay for sex drunk, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. Go out there and what? Find the guy and help him. Who the hell are you tonight? If it's a guy. It's a guy. I saw it's him. It's a dead guy. Well, dead alive. Come on, man. This guy. is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. Both of us? I mean, I don't know. Me? I hit the fucking guy. One of us should stay here, though, in case. No, no, go out together. The gun. Why are you guys idiots? Okay. Well. Shit. Okay. Here, we'll rock paper scissors for it. Fuck. 
I want to go. <laughs> okay, cool. Good. This I want to be the one to go. We need to hurry up. You ready? Man, I can't believe I'm doing this shit. Dude, two seconds, it's over. All right, two out of three, right? Sure. One, two, three, go. Shit. All right, all right. Okay. All right. One, two, three, go. Fuck! What are the chances of that? Okay. One, two, three, go. He beat me. Lock your scissors, dude. Eddie. Yeah, sorry. Got caught up. All right, dude. This is it. Shit. One, two, three, go. <laughs> Shit, man. <laughs> Insane. Okay. Again. One, two, three, go. Just poke me in the eyes while your fingers are like that, huh? Scissors blow. But I know I wanted. Like it's me. Oh, I should have lost. Just let me go, it's fine. Bro, why'd you move over? Eddie! What? What? Do you see anything out there? I can't see a goddamn thing. Eddie! <laughs> you should get back in the car! No fucking way, man! What if it was you? Eddie! <laughs> Hurry up, man! Dude, leave me the fuck alone, all right? This is my speed. He kind of reminds me of Shaggy. Jeez, we need to get out of here quick. Way to go, idiot! Did it fool? Hey, Wyatt. I ate paint when I was a kid. Die. Shit, where the hell did they go? This is the smallest hoopty in the world. Hey, maybe I can see better with that guy on. Oh. This does not feel good. There you are, you piece of shit. It's always there. Or it's between the seat and like the console part. Shit! Ah! Come here, you little bastard. Rats! Wait, no, we're good. Oh, wait, we need the keys in that. My bad. Oh, son of a bitch! Did I have a choice? I'm wondering. I just think if I'm down here, you can see what's happening. Yeah. I think I'm gonna keep it like that. Oh, oh god, that was loud. <laughs> Scared me. Was that? Could I not not leave him behind then? Oh. Oh wait, who are we then? I guess we're choosing. Oh, this is pretty cool. Getting everyone's different backstories. Okay, we're 184 days in. I think it was 41 last time. Got like 60 miles left, I think. Ain't shit. We must have just recently uh, graduated, though, so we're pretty young. Ago. Hey, you getting up? <laughs> Good. Does he not have like any sort Maybe of weapons? He can't. I should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. Is this the same truck? Oh, yuck. Fucking gross, man.
I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. Shit, bro. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No. No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't... What's your name? Russell. So you didn't steal that bag. I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Because I mean, you it steal is from mine. Me and I'll get your throat out. I don't care who you run around with, you understand? It's mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on, scoot. I ain't gonna wait forever. You take me to Statesboro? I'm trying to get to my grand's house. Fuck, she liked the party? Just get in, we'll get there. Or somewhere, eventually. Um... I don't know! I don't know if I trust him. Your name's Nate, by the way. Thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh... Here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? This is the fucking apocalypse. This is like... nothing. No, I'm just good, alright? Alright, alright. You wanna tell me about where you come from, at least? Must have been with Ew. the crew. <laughs> oh. Any tail back where you come from? Maybe drop you off, do a double back. He's like, dude, what? No, uh, tail. Damn. I retract my question. There was a girl who I liked, all right. The argument's semantics, Russ. Give a pal the deets. <sighs> all right. There was seven of us. I didn't have any family there or nothing. They're all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. Then a teacher and his wife. <gasps> Leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so we didn't add nobody to the group. We found survivors. It was the same every time. He... He... Let it out, Paco. Just... We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then he bang, mentioned the teacher in the black and thought Lee. Anyway, I don't know. I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. I slipped out of there. I couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. What would you give her? Strong six? Just tell me something about her. How was the rack? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I'll put it right in here. Ew. Why you gotta be like that? Like what? Always talking about women like that. Women? <laughs> okay, well, let, let me see if I can answer your question. Because, because the hunger a man's got for a woman is all we got left now. No laws, no jobs, ain't nothing that make us men. But they ain't eating all the women yet. Whatever. Ah. Let's try this again. All right, maybe someone who wasn't so near and dear to your heart then. What the fuck? Come on, scale of one to ten. What do you think? Slamming before she was gone, right? Dang. Here, get a look. Fuck! Like a nice, right? Maybe they got high standards. If you say five, I'm gonna be a fool. I didn't I didn't want to say it's but I didn't want to get any kills. Did you load that? Oh, it's in the glove bag.
Oh wait. This was from the intro. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. You just almost tried Fine, to kill me. Be mad. Just stop being a pussy. I. Oh shit! Go! Get out! Oh no. Russ! Get the fuck down, man! You don't want to be there! Get to the truck! I'll cover you! Okay. Get ready! Don't stop running! And keep your head down! Where are we? Where are we going? I'm confused. Did we not just... Good hustle. What happened to... I'll cover you! Look how good you did. I don't know, man. Fuck, we're screwed. You haven't been shot at in three months? Come on, kid, look at me. This is no big deal. We got this, okay? Okay. First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. I wanna Just trust him because... <laughs> Why didn't you do it? Come on, just sit down. He's from there. See? Easy. Now we know where he is, we can fucking get him. All right. Yeah. That's the spirit. Let's push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. I don't... I don't know what to do here. I don't want to trust him, but I feel like Shit. I have to. Just keep He's pushing! the tire. Oh my god. around the side of the building we gotta go from cover to cover okay Seriously, this time i'm not fucking around you gonna cover me if we get to that car we'll be out of the line of fire here it has no bullets i'm not fucking around you cover me then i'll cover you or if you want to go first that's fine too i'm gonna go fast i'll go first boy, russ haul ass he noted my choice, but I don't care. I'm going first. Oh, sorry. Oh, he is actually covering me this time. Great. All right, I'm good. Heads up. Nice. My bad. I thought I got it. As soon as you start shooting, I'm coming. Over there and we should be good. Go! <gasps> Wait, we're by a tank. Thanks. We're not done yet. Let's see if we can get in around back. Sneak up on this ass. Follow me. This is so intense. <laughs> Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? What do you mean, we? Come on. Watch out for that. What's the problem? <laughs> Is it still dangerous? Probably. Isn't that? I swear they mentioned. You mentioned the cop. Feel like a big man now? <laughs> Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Keep your head down and follow me. You got it. All right. We're gonna be fucking. Sneak up on this son of a bitch. Well, I'm not good at stealth, so. Not a fucking beep. Let's go. 
Oh my god. This reminds me of the David section, especially since it kind of looks the same, this part. I see him. Check through the window. See if there's anyone else. No, just him. I think. I think I saw a guy. Oh. No shit. I'll cover you. Why Stop. can't you? Just jump out, grab. Your call. I don't know how the dude wouldn't be hearing that door. Especially in the silence. <gasps> don't fucking move! Walt! Get the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here! Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook! First off, watch the fucking racism. This is my boy. Secondly, I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. Mask? What's he talking about? Fuck if I know. He's crazy. Have you been here before? Russell, don't you start. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, no. just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? No. Russell. Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up! There are real fucking monsters out there! No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I seen! Fuck you, Nate! I saved your ass! You didn't do shit! Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on! Can we still be friends? No. You stood up and walked away. Don't shoot. No, I'm sorry, that's just really annoyed me. That's genuinely just really, really annoyed me. What the actual hell? Why? Like, are you being serious? Oh. Okay, got one. A snake for a tongue. You are so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Okay, Bonnie, 220 days in. Can I control this snake, or does it have free reign? Free reign? Well... I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Lobster claws. Weirdo. <laughs> Think of all the crazy stuff you could grab. All I'm saying is, good luck finding a man if you have lobster hands. Good thing I'm not looking for one, then. Are these two together? Okay. How about... Oh, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. So, uh, you gotta admit, anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. Uh, what I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. Take a hike, Big Ears. I resemble that remark. You resemble a satellite. You know, you weren't so damn sassy before. Did yes, she get shot in her side? side? Cause she's holding... Like, I mean it, though. Yeah. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out oh, of the drugs. wood yet, I know, but well, you've come a long way, Bonnie, and I'm proud of you. You're a good friend, Leland. 
Did I just I friend zone him? Okay, you're not that great. Look, you know I ain't going nowhere, right? I feel like he is. Together, I'll be there. You say that remark. Don't worry. Out. You know that, right? Slow down, Leland. Bonnie. Yeah. Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. <gasps> I found us something. No. What are you two up to? No. Where have you been, D? We were just talking oh, no. we for you. Uh, and what were you talking about? Oh, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters. Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot for the food. You, know? uh, Lee, you hate fishing. That ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? Oh. I go fishing all the time. Thought you, didn't I? I am a catch. <laughs> Don't I know it. Damn. I got you a present. Oh. You shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we got to get moving. Does she think we... Wait, I thought they were together. Now I'm just confused. So, where'd you get the bag, D? D? D, did you hear me? What's in the bag, D? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, D, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, D, that, that bad. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, D, you gotta give us more than that. Was anyone there? I don't think so. You don't think? Or you don't know. Those mean the same thing, Leland. Just tell us, baby. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. Oh, it's the last one? month. Huh? All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one Hush, who stopped. Hush, your voice is down. But Come you are now. the one who made me stop. Irregardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I have about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now You're we're gonna draw every dead thing from miles around in you keep on goddamn like this. middle of nowhere you place. On you listen to me now. I have had it up I to here with listening to you. To blaspheme. I can't believe. Oh, forget the both of you. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. We can sort this out. Oh, Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will, right, Dee? We, we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bonnie, darling, I'm, I'm sorry we're... Darling! Dee, come on. Oh. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. Oh. Dee, now's not the time. I, I refuse to get in the middle of this. Well, too bad. You already are. I'm sorry. I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can... Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, God, run. Come on. We gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh, shit. Wait up, y'all! Y'all. Hide in the bushes. Maybe I shouldn't have shouted. Fields. Oh my Hey Layla Through here look Shit. Sounded like he was coming hey. from the left.
Oh no. I didn't know. <laughs> Why am I so bad at this game? I didn't know where I was supposed to be going. D! Okay. I think I saw something over here. Where are you? Spread out. It can't be far. I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, there's... Anything? No, I can't see a damn thing out here. Okay. Mama, watch over me. Okay, Bonnie. Stay calm. Find a weapon. Press and hold A. Uh. What the hell is that? No, that's... Oh. That looked like D. It looked like she had the same hairstyle. I can't with this game! Uh. How could she do that with her short shoulder? It was D. D. Oh God, D. I I'm so sorry. Oh God. Why? You. Why? Do. Do. Do I love you? How bad is it? Why didn't you say anything? You. You should have said something. You. You did this. Oh, God, you killed me. You, you killed me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never tr trusted you. Just, just a junkie. Leland, <laughs> she, she did this to me. I, God, I'm so sorry. So, I can't. Oh, God. I knew you fuck up again. <laughs> Take him. I... I... No, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You... Bitch. Mary wanted him. Didn't... Thank you. Help us don't. God damn you. There... is something between us. I but don't know what to say. This isn't the right thing, this, but... God. Junkie. I should have lied. Why did e, I say that? E, did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? Do we lie? E. Oh, God, what happened? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know. I could lie. Your face. Her face, Bonnie. I, I don't know. I, I found her like this. How did this happen? Why didn't you wait for me? Oh. I shouldn't have lied. Oh, I feel sick. She deserves a proper burial. We can't just leave her here in a fucking cornfield. We can't leave her like this. Help me move her. Bonnie, please. 
We can't take her with us. I, oh, what if she turns I'm into awful. one of them things? Do that. Leyland. Keep moving. You gotta be closing in. Okay. God, okay. But I don't... You got anything to say to her? I'm sorry, Dee. I really, truly am. She loved you, Bonnie. I'm sorry. In what way? Do this to you, darling. I'm confused Do about this here? relationship. What is... This way. What is happening here? I know it's hard, but I need you, Leland. <laughs> I think I saw something over here. Die for this thing, I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. The bag. Maybe it was their bag, actually. That's why they're coming after us. I actually feel awful. I I don't know what what I was on making those choices. Because it clearly wasn't sanity. <laughs> okay, that's Bonnie's one. Should we do Vince or she Shell? Let's do Vince. Damn it. I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. I don't even I don't even know you, bro. What? <laughs> Getting really hot. We're in Macon. Wait, are these all in Macon? That's the drugstore though, Shit. right? No, we're keeping it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess it made no difference. Oh, we're two days in. Come on, man. You don't listen to this crap anymore. Two hours. Think it'll clear up soon? What am I, the traffic man? I'm supposed to have been at the pen an hour ago. Can't believe these rid. assholes are letting us roast. Oh, relax. Is that your fault? What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince. Justin's gonna make me. It's too hot for this shit. Vince, I'm making him hot now. You guys ever gonna quit? How else are we gonna pass the time? <laughs> hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The window hey, door. Justin. That shit ain't See that right, guy man. in the beat up that truck? Shit ain't right. I bet he Shut lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit. I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey, how many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You telling me there wasn't a star witness waiting around in your white van? I'm shocked. We're all in the same boat here. What's the point of arguing? The point is, I'm not like that. <laughs> My lawyer's gonna be hearing Tell about you what, this. Guys, he gonna I have your afraid to say it. Jobs when he I'm hears about really this. missing my girlfriend right now. I'm oh, guessing. I wonder why. Business, it's I worse than that, man. She won't talk to me. I haven't heard her what? in months. What? You think? You, you think she'd want to? Real. <laughs> That's before you here. Oh man. I want to, but you know, I love her, man. What's it matter, man? You're headed to jail. Never heard of a conjugal visit? Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you, but you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from White Collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? 
hotter than hell up in here. I'm getting dehydrated. Hey, Ew. How about some water back Why is he looking at us? Shut I thought you took the there. stand and cried your eyes out. Telling you again. Didn't you lose your yeah, shit and tell them you didn't know what you were up, doing? Or I'll set you I up. lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? Nah, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. What then? It just ain't right. You should have been a man about it. I can't believe I'm getting my moralistic shit kicked in by a couple of criminals. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh... A pyramid scheme. How'd you live with yourself? Easy. <laughs> I didn't think about it. I'm so confused as to what's going on here. Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, So boy. he stole from people. Oh, oh. When he we get someone. out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? Don't you know, even want to say what he did. I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. Two kids? You touch a couple kids, Vince? I helped my little brother. They send you to prison for that now? He was in trouble. I had to. I don't want to boast. I knew it was something stupid. You regret it, man? If you're saying what I think you are, I got respect for you, man. But that's a hard thing to carry, you know? I don't regret it at all. Sometimes. You gotta do the hard thing. Yeah, I know what you mean. How'd they get you? Tossed the gun up on a roof. And? It was a good throw, and the roofer found it the <laughs> next day. You, know you gotta be is. kidding me. This is man, you're bad luck, Vince. Punishment, man. Bad luck, Vince! <laughs> <rights. laughs> That's not I'm bad. You, man. What do you think, Shut Justin? The fuck up. What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? Fuck you! Fuck me? <laughs> There's a fuck fight! Fuck you, motherfucker! Oh, shit. oh man, Christ. what the hell is going on back Red there? Red knock it off! Hey, get in there, man! Got? Sit down, goddammit! Hey, let him go, man! Damn it, Crabtree! Don't make me come back there! He's man. Man. gonna kill him, Vince! Well, what you handle it, guys? Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do oh, not want to get in the middle of that shit, Danny. Motherfucker. Vince, we gotta do something! You know this ain't right! I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Where's your empathy, man? can't do anything with these damn chains on. Shit. Crabtree, I'm warning you one He's last time. Listening, God damn it. You gotta get in there. Get yourself in there. Wake that shit up, on, man. Come on, boy. Get back there. Okay, asshole. Let him go. Get in between them, God damn it. He's gonna kill that boy. Crabtree? Last what warning. Are you for? Knock him out. Go, God damn it. I didn't mean... What the fuck was that? Fuck. Jesus. What happened? What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy! Answer me back there! That guy's there. still alive! Get those cuffs off him, man! What the hell was that? He he made a move on me! I, I, I don't know! He's still bleeding? He didn't do- He's, uh, He didn't do fuck. anything! You, you gotta call someone, man! What? I'm calling this in. Don't. Don't call it in yet. Just, just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute. You killed that guy. You gotta deal with it, man. I just need a minute. I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute. Shut up, you hear me? Just shut your mouth. Okay, okay. Calm down. Take it easy. I'm not I'll gonna say anything. Down. You quit running your fucking mouth. Everything's cool. Just take a breath, okay? Uh... Let's take a page out of Vince's book here. It's all of us just quiet down, okay? You're the only one speaking. What are you doing? You really want to pull that trigger again, son? Thanks, man. That dude's gonna turn into a walker, though. What the fuck? Get us the hell out of here. You're not going anywhere. Fuck that. Get this bus moving. 
Hey, driver! I said let's go, man! We're staying right here! We're safe inside the bus! Nothing's gonna... Holy shit! Jesus! Oh my god! Hey! Hey! You need to call someone! You hear me? We need to... Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus! Where is the show gone? Back up, back up! Fuck! 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 The chains. Us. You sure about that? That ankle's gonna get. Shit. What are we doing, guys? Come on. We gotta do something. Find a weapon. What kind of weapon? Anything. Where's the guard's gun? Yeah. Yeah, the gun. Good thinking, Justin. Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath it. Oh, fuck me. I'm actually getting so stressed. Get the gun, man. Pick it up, kids. Hurry up. Can't. Shoot this asshole, Vince. Do it. Oh, watch it, man. Sorry. Sorry. Man. I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. Are we gonna shoot we the chains off the, the front locks? Of the if that cage door is unlocked. If we can get out of these chains. How are we gonna get out of here? Whoa, whoa, watch it. Ain't gonna work. Really? Where are the damn keys, man? They weren't oh. on it. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. <laughs> Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, don't. buddy! <gasps> what the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot in you, man. We gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. That's not gonna hold. Vince, fire the fucking gun! At what? It's a shotgun. I think you just pissed them off. Yeah, yeah, save the shells. The chamber threw that loop as well as the floor. Yeah! Point. How the hell are we gonna get out There's of here? There's gotta be a way. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way. Wouldn't These guys, the I'm losing if actual sanity right out, are you playing insane? this what do you think section. Gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's throat? Well, what do you think is going to happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We got to do this. Back off. What? Vince, what the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm hey, not shooting them. You're a good guy. Come on! You know I'm a good guy, man! I'm sorry, man. Fuck you! Do it! Hurry! Justin's just gonna slow you down. I... I... Do it again! Come on, let's go! I hated that one. I hated that one. What the hell? I did not like that one one bit. I actually feel so sick now. Was there a way I could have escaped with both of them? I'm kind of thinking no. I think in these games, like, it's usually one or the other. Oh, is it the diner again? Wait. She kind of looks like Max from Life is Strange. 
Okay, shell. 236 days in. Hey, shell. Your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know. Okay, we're playing her story, else. I think. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? I'm trying to protect her from it as much as possible. Things are stable here, for now. I wanted to grow up with this, not what's outside these walls. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times. She's gonna go through that. But if we can keep She's her so from cute. experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? As long as it doesn't distract from keeping this place safe, that's always the priority. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Okay, but be careful. People's lives depend on those. We can't have them screwing up because we got lazy. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Okay. Eesh, these <clears throat> knives are looking pretty ragged. Don't worry, they're on our list. <laughs> She's so cute. Did you ever find out what happened there? No. Roman said it was like this when he and Stephanie found the uh... place. Could be anything these days, though. Still, better not to think about it. Well, I know what happened there. Hey, Becca, think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh, yeah. Then we can spend all our money at nowhere. <laughs> Okay. I can't tell if she liked that or not. How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. <laughs> huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. <gasps> you guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. The diner looked pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. Oh my god. Wait, we never found out what was in the bag. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. That must be nice, though. Being able to put your own touches to the place, especially since it is like a diner. I keep missing stuff. Okay, fine, I can't get around there. That was a waste of time. <laughs> oh. Okay. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Smart. Hmm. Oh. This hasn't worked in a long time. Coffee! God, what it would be for a cup of coffee in the morning. Don't love a good coffee. Damn, this do be a bit of a maze. Ooh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. Scared me. <laughs> He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. I 
feel bad Are for Are those Ds? Yeah, well, at least we found a way for him to be useful. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best, but it's really not. It's better than the alternative. I'd rather she have a shorter, happy experience in this world than one full of fear and death and horror. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. Where's the garden? Okay. What is this one eating? Oh, God. Is it an animal? I'm gonna be honest, I can't tell. I think it's like a, a, a rabbit maybe, or a deer head. Probably a rabbit. That would make the most sense. I guess we just go back in. I feel like that was a waste of time. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that don't wasn't ever funny. fucking do that again. Oh. Whoa, what's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. I'm sorry. Why was that so it's, sad, though? It's just the watchdogs. Like, I guess they found a, a puppy. Oh! A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. It looked you more know, like a was, rabbit or a deer head. so little. A small deer head. I don't think about but babies yeah. anymore, but after a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. But then, you know, there it is. You see it and you want to protect it and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Is she talking about her sister? Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell, Becca, something's going on outside. Not the garden. What is it? Not the beautiful know, garden. bad. We gotta find Roman. I bet it's the garden. So where's the greenery? Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. Let's mark them. If so, care we be Jesus. Largum. My God. Largum. What did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck it's in. the second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. They got away with more medicine than we. We're gonna have to, to choose to let him go well, and kill him. We all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. And send him on but his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouting. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. We can't take the risk of letting him go, but why not let him stay? I guess that would be okay. We could always okay, use sure more hands that. keeping the place secure. Boy, we don't need any more people here. And look at him. How is he, he gonna... can't even speak English. That this doesn't work do because any... we know Come how to on. communicate. That is racist. But we, we can find can a way, find for, him a to way for him to help. <sighs> well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. Vernon was out for the boat the whole time. And 
the second they left that boat unattended, we oh just Oh my god, it's these guys! That's when our group fell apart. He I can't didn't even know to, I didn't even recognize him! I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's I stop did... dancing around. Oh my god. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. <sighs> Oh. Jesus Christ. Are you serious? Uh -huh. Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. Yeah. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? I'm just gonna let him go. We have to set him free. We, we told He's Becca. He's not even armed. Well, we, we can't was, just kill him. Said, this isn't in self-defense. Isn't it though? If it means he can't come back to hurt us, that isn't the same thing. But last time, Joyce, that was a long time ago. If we kill this man, then we're giving up a part of ourselves that we can never get back. We want. I want to teach Becca to do. I'm or still have that go. morals in a world where it's very hard to set the line on where morals stand. Cut him free. I hope you guys know what you're doing. Oh, Give him have? some food, when, three or four cans, just as a gesture of good faith, and get him out of here. I don't know if you can understand a word I'm saying, but you better understand this. You came this close to death today, and if you ever ever come near this place again or she tell looks anybody like Lily. where we are you wish you had died today two hundred and fifty nine days in do you have any fours? Don't nope. say that decision's gonna come back to bite me. Do you have any sevens? Yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. I mean, it was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? Since the attack, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I shouldn't have let that guy go. Boyd would still be alive and everything would be the same. Boyd agreed it was the right thing to do. Anyway, Roman's obsessed with keeping this place secured now. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Did anyone see you leave? No, no one saw me. You've got to stop doing that. I feel You're like gonna she's get us gonna both die. in a lot of trouble. I don't see why it's such a big deal. We had another break in just last month. Uh, Becca, you know what it means if someone were to see you and follow you back here. No one is following me. There's no one else out there. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Give us a minute. Yeah. Just don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I, I get I want to be honest with her. I feel like sometimes when you lie, like the character you're meant to be looking after, it, it just, it's not right. It doesn't go well. Let's just say that. How come no one's watering these? Okay. What's going on? Something definitely is... Sus. Joyce, do you know what's going on? I don't know if I should say anything. Please, what is it? 
Someone better. Than... They caught Stephanie stealing, and then trying to escape. Oh my God! What are they gonna do? I don't know. What can we do? I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Oh my God. Is she in the truck? Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? Have they put a walker? Or trying to escape. And her in the truck? Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? No! Yeah, you want me to take care of it. You and Boyd were the ones who fought to let that guy go. Convinced us all to take that chance. But we did. And it was wrong. And now Boyd is dead. We're beyond the luxury of taking chances now. And I need to know that you're with us 100%. Oh my god. Let's talk to her first. See if we can talk some sense into her. No. She tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra a... ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. She don't we have to bear. Like you're she one person. Try to leave Come so on. Quietly. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say. I'll back you up. Ah! Why am I so bad at decision making games? Shell? What's wrong? Can am we just I say she trouble? was bitten by Walker? What I'm gonna say is gonna be hard to hear. What is it? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of ammo and medicine and tried to escape oh my god the hell did she do that for Roman says we have to kill her yeah why would she do this to us she's just scared she made a mistake that'll be our last mistake Becca Stephanie is your friend was my friend she's becoming Roman so angry and it. like vengeful I'm sorry. Uh, let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. I bet, like, this wouldn't have had to be a decision I made if I just let him go last time. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. But we're not. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, you know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No! No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. 
he probably will hunt them down. And they'll just be living life in danger. And as Becca said, they wouldn't have anything in the van. They wouldn't have anywhere to go. I really played this horribly. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Me too. I don't. <sighs> Four hundred days in. Oh, we were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. Wait, what? How many are we talking about? <gasps> Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. Oh my god! It's really hot. Oh my god. I found him. Holy shit. Good job. Everything okay? So far, so good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Is that all of yeah, them together, luck. though? Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. We should probably split up into two parts. You got it. Hey! Bonnie? Don't you. Vince! Vince? Russell? Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? And how? My name is Tavia. Shell. A name. How did you find us? And Wyatt. But go about him. I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but... I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because she says it's true doesn't mean it is. You should know about that. At least what I did was an accident. Hey, that's enough. I heard rumors about these places. This guy I was traveling with ditched me trying to find one in his own. What happened to Leyland? He thought... Leyland? You know what? Let's do this. She looks well fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Wait, you find survivors? Do you find a lot? Not as many anymore, but... Well, we gotta go. Eddie might be there. Why? Look, we need people. Plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm gonna be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Chell. Why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were gonna defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. What will it take to convince you? I don't know. Russell, come on. I don't understand what the problem is. Are you really considering staying out here? Foraging for food like fucking raccoons? I mean, then why did we even leave the photos there? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? You clearly outnumber me. If you wanted to overpower me, you could. Hell, I'll even go along as your hostage until you feel safe. No one is gonna hurt you. That's not a bad idea, actually. And I'll do it. Because I know when you guys see this place, you'll change your minds. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. 
choice is yours. Is how so, I play their stories who depending on me? who's gonna come with me? Yeah. I'm going. Yeah, I have to. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting out? Yes! Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. Some of you may have been separated from friends or family. It's a long shot, but there's a chance you could find them there. Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. Okay, but I swear to God, if you try anything, you're gonna regret it. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. But understand that I can't promise anything. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? Burn them. This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? You don't. Just say the wrong option. I just felt like that was the most fitting. I don't want to give them false hope, you know? Oh my god, okay. So, 30%, I was in the minority with shooting off Danny's foot. 50% stayed in the car, 50% got out. I can't remember what that was for. <laughs> Left Nate, 75% of players did. We lied to Leland and we killed Stephanie. See, it's just interesting because I didn't know how it was gonna... No! Oh my god. Was that because I didn't make them leave in the RV? Okay. That was the DLC though. Oh my god. Okay. Is that D? I, I think that's D. Oh god. Oh, is it showing? Okay. Great. But yeah, no, I actually really enjoyed that. I really liked how it was set out and how you were playing the mini stories within like a big story and they all came together in the end. I would have liked to known like what happened to Leland how did these guys get away I think it mentioned a tiny bit of it but not enough for me to actually get the full picture on like why they left or how they left because the whole reason why I didn't make them leave was because it mentioned that Roman would have come after them and I didn't want that if I knew that they were all gonna meet together at the end I would have chosen differently I think on many accounts but I didn't obviously because I haven't played it before so that's kind of why I made the choices that I did it was really interesting though and I like the shorter stories I we were talking about it on Twitch I personally don't like it when singular episodes of games I personally don't like it when they go over two hours mainly just because I like uploading them in episode segments I don't like doing episode part one episode part two blah 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 I prefer it when the episodes are like two hours or less because I feel like that's a good amount of time to get everything that you need in an episode whilst also retain the player's attention throughout all of it maybe I just have a shorter attention span and that's why I'm more so against longer episodes and chapters. Editing them is also hard if they go over two hours. It's just a lot. But yeah, personally, I just like shorter episodes and chapters just because I think it just, it will contain a lot of filler, which I don't like. I'm not a huge fan of filler, personally, especially if you can tell if it's filler. If it's filler and you can't tell it's filler, like, I, I got granted this in, like, in this type of game, you're gonna get filler. But if you can clearly tell that it's all just filler, it gets hard to stay in it, especially if you're just playing it three hours straight. But then I don't want to do, like, the 
part one episode part two it's like a whole thing basically but i really enjoyed that i think now we've done all of the episodes in season one anyway oh you can still see the stats from this scene but yeah next time we will be going on to season two which is very exciting i love this picture i love just seeing this i want to look at the art gallery oh my gosh oh my god wait what clementine and lee oh these were the different outfits herschel and sean oh these are those guys yeah i didn't realize like they connected it is so cool seeing artwork and stuff Oh, this, this was so sad. There are so many scenes within this game where it is just really sad. But yes, next time we will be starting season two. She's a bit older. Clementine's journey continues as she learns to survive in a world gone mad. When everyone is out for themselves, who can she trust? I'm very, very excited for that. But I'm going to leave that there for today's part. I'm gonna leave that there for the entirety of season one. I hope you enjoyed it and hopefully I'll see you in season two. Okay, bye.